Insurance Institute for Highway Safety just released this new report. It tracked car accidents in the first states to legalize pot for recreational use. The IIHS looked at Colorado, Nevada, Oregon, and Washington. They found the number of collision insurance claims rose as much as 6% in those states compared to neighboring states where marijuana is still illegal. Polls have shown many people don't believe marijuana impacts driving ability like alcohol and it can be challenging for police to detect. The difficulty is, is unlike alcohol, where you can actually measure uh, a blood alcohol concentration level, you can't do that currently with marijuana. Police departments are now training officers to better recognize drivers who are high. And several states are testing new devices like saliva swabs that can identify drugs in the system. That testing may help states like California, one of the most recent states to legalize recreational marijuana. Already, authorities are tracking accidents in the San Francisco area and predict there will be a 142 percent jump in the number of traffic collisions involving drivers under the influence of marijuana by the end of the year. So the study looked at a lot of stuff and found that 14 percent of drivers pulled over for being under the influence of pot had a child in the car. Back to you.